from Bigfoot hiding behind trees, a bear vandalizing a car, to an abandoned town filled with lost souls. These are just a few of the things we will look at, so stick to the end. In the video, the camera captures a brief glimpse of a creature as the car drives past the leafless forest. It stands upright on two legs, covered in brown fur, similar to what we imagine Bigfoot would look like. The moment is fleeting and leaves us with questions. Could this be a rare encounter with a mysterious being? Or is it simply a trick of the light and shadows between the trees? While it's tempting to believe in the possibility of a Bigfoot sighting, common sense suggests it might just be the forest playing visual tricks as we pass by. Personally, I lean towards the latter explanation. The woods are full of natural illusions, especially when viewed from a moving vehicle. In a video shot by someone in the woods, we see something that catches our attention. It's a big, hairy creature walking on two legs, kind of like how we'd imagine Bigfoot to walk. It's covered in black hair and moves in a way that makes us wonder if it could be an animal we know or something more mysterious. The creature doesn't seem to notice it's being filmed as it walks behind the trees. It's just a short clip, but it's enough to make us think about all the stories of Bigfoot we've heard. Honestly, while the video is pretty interesting, I think we've got to be careful before jumping to conclusions. The woods are full of animals that can look strange in the right light, so it could be just a normal animal looking unusual from a distance. In the calm of a wooded area, a couple films the peaceful scenery. The trees stand tall, their leaves whispering secrets. The camera shakes slightly as the man points out something moving behind the foliage. It's hard to see clearly, but he's certain there's something there. So much so, that he circles the area in the video to show us where to look. There's a suggestion of a hairy creature hiding just out of clear view. Then, the quiet of the woods is broken by a series of strange noises. The sounds grow louder, and unexpectedly, one of the trees begins to topple. Oh shit, no one! Listen, come on! Shake, come here! Shake, come here! Shake, come here! It's a startling moment that transforms a serene nature video into something more suspenseful. Watching the video, I can understand why the man is so convinced he saw something. The woods are full of life, much of which we seldom see. It's easy for the imagination to fill in the gaps when we hear unexpected sounds or see the trees move. Although I can't see the creature he's talking about, the falling tree certainly adds a dramatic twist that leaves us wondering what's really going on in that forest. Oh shit, no one! Listen, come on! Shake, come here! Shake, come here! Shake, come here! From a parking lot, a man captures an unusual and intense encounter on camera. A black bear, an imposing creature of the wild, has wandered into a space of asphalt and vehicles. The bear is not just passing through, it's perched atop two cars, using them as a makeshift bridge. With surprising intelligence, it tugs at the door of one car, persistent in its efforts. Despite the sturdiness of the car, the bear's strength is on full display as it manages to shatter the window. The man filming takes action. Hey, go! Trying to scare the bear off to prevent further damage. Undeterred, the bear moves with a clumsy grace, climbing on top of the car, owning it for a moment. As the situation escalates, the bear then transitions to the adjacent vehicle, and just like that, the video cuts off, leaving the outcome hanging in suspense. Watching this, there's a mix of admiration for the bear's adaptability and a pang of concern for the safety of both the animal and the people nearby. It's a stark reminder that when nature and human territories collide, the results can be unpredictable. Personally, I can't help but feel that this bear, though out of its element, showcases the wild's raw persistence in the face of human encroachment. 
caught on a surveillance camera with a view to a window, something startling appears. For about three seconds, a strange-looking creature pops into the frame. We can't make out its face or the details of its body, but one thing seems clear. It doesn't look like any person. Then, as quickly as it came, the creature vanishes from sight. The brief appearance of this being raises more questions than answers. Could it be a skinwalker, as some might speculate, or is there a simpler explanation? The video doesn't give us much to go on, just a fleeting glimpse that could set imaginations running wild. In my view, while the idea of a skinwalker is intriguing, it's also important to consider more ordinary possibilities before jumping to supernatural conclusions. It's the unknown that often captures our curiosity, but sometimes, what seems extraordinary might just be a trick of light or shadow. From the viewpoint of a moving car, a camera films a peculiar sight across the road, a humanoid shadow dashing at an unnerving speed. It's there one moment and gone the next, only to reappear, charging towards the car. The eyes of the figure shine strangely, which is especially unsettling. The entire encounter lasts but a moment, and the figure's non-human appearance leaves a chilling impression. The speed and the eerie glow of the eyes might suggest something out of the ordinary. Could it be something supernatural? It's a question that hangs in the air as the footage plays out. In my opinion, while the video certainly gives off a mysterious vibe, there's likely a practical explanation. Perhaps it's just a person caught in the right light, or maybe a trick of the camera. Whatever it is, it's a reminder of how easily the ordinary can seem extraordinary under the right circumstances. In a serene lakeside scene, a woman is seen gently feeding a turtle a simple act of connection with nature. The calm is unexpectedly shattered when another lake inhabitant, a creature with a reptilian appearance, emerges with a startling display of aggression. In a swift movement, it lunges for the bread in the woman's hand, its behavior more akin to an attack than a bid for a snack. The sudden change from a peaceful interaction to an alarming encounter raises questions. What could have caused such a dramatic shift in the demeanor of the lake's creatures? Was the reptilian creature simply eager for food, or was there something more behind its aggressive approach? Reflecting on the video, it seems that even in moments of tranquility, the wild instincts of animals can surface, reminding us of the unpredictable nature of wildlife. It's a powerful reminder to always be mindful of our surroundings when interacting with animals, even in seemingly calm situations. A man films the autumnal woods, where the leaves paint the ground in shades of brown. At first, there's just a whisper of movement, a shadow that could be anything. Then the shadow comes to life, revealing a large, furry black creature that skillfully climbs a tree. It looks similar to what people say Bigfoot looks like. This brief sighting stirs the imagination. Could it be the elusive creature many have searched for, or is it simply one of the forest's known inhabitants, like a bear? The idea of Bigfoot has always sparked curiosity and debate. Personally, I think the woods hold many secrets, and sometimes they let us catch a glimpse. Whether this is a rare animal or the legendary Bigfoot, it's a fascinating peek into the hidden life of the forest. Through the lens of a surveillance camera, we observe a dimly lit hallway within what appears to be a warehouse. A single light casts a glow in the darkness. Suddenly, a shadow flickers across the screen. As the camera continues to roll, the figure becomes slightly more visible, yet it remains shrouded in mystery. This fleeting appearance might chill the spine of anyone thinking of ghost stories and unexplained phenomena. 
It's a shape that fits the eerie tales told in hushed tones. But in the stark reality of a warehouse hallway, can such things truly wander? From my point of view, while the footage is certainly intriguing, I'm inclined to think there's a logical explanation. Perhaps it's just a trick of light or a reflection that creates this ghostly effect. After all, cameras and shadows often play tricks on us, especially in the dark. A surveillance camera gives us a peek into the backyard of what might be a farm, focused on a hen house. There's a hen and a rooster scratching around outside. The rooster strolls into the hen house, and just as the hen is about to follow, a hawk swoops down with predatory speed. The scene is tense, the hen seemingly no match for the hawk. But then the rooster emerges, bravely confronting the hawk. Against the odds, it's the rooster that triumphs, the hawk retreating to the sky, leaving the hen unharmed. Hawks attacking birds like hens isn't unheard of, but it's a rare glimpse into the raw realities of nature's pecking order. Watching this, you can't help but admire the rooster's courage. While it's unusual for a hawk to take such a risk near human dwellings, it's a reminder that the wild is always close by and sometimes it comes knocking, or swooping, right in our backyards. A man is recording a 360 degree video near an abandoned building. As the camera spins around, it briefly captures a shadowy figure in one of the building's windows. The spin is quick, too fast to make out any details on the first pass. The video then replays, slowing down and zooming in on the window. Now clearer, we see what looks like the figure of a girl, a child with braided hair standing in the window. Yet the stark reality of the abandoned place suggests there couldn't really be a child there. It begs the question, are we seeing a ghost? Or could this be a trick of computer-generated imagery? The image certainly stirs the imagination. In my opinion, while the figure looks convincing, the likelihood of CG or another form of visual manipulation seems high, especially given the setting and context. It's a reminder that technology can create nearly as many mysteries as it solves. From high above the ocean, a drone captures a group of surfers, blissfully unaware as they wait for the next wave. But there's something else in the water with them. A great white shark, its powerful form, cutting through the water with ease. The drone's camera follows the shark's movements, almost holding our breath as it edges closer to the surfers who remain oblivious to the predator's presence. And then, just when tension peaks, the great white turns away, leaving the surfers unharmed. It's unusual for these sharks to venture into shallow waters so close to humans, a behavior that puzzles and alarms. In my view, this encounter is a stark reminder of nature's unpredictability. While the surfers were fortunate this time, the presence of the shark so near to shore is a rare and cautionary sight. It's a testament to the wildness that lies just beneath the surface, beyond our control, but within our respect. A trail camera, stationed in the quiet of the woods, stands sentinel capturing the nightly comings and goings of forest denizens. On this night, it records an oddity, an animal that at first glance defies identification, hairless and almost alien in appearance. As the creature lingers in the camera's gaze, it becomes clear. This is an opossum, albeit one without its characteristic fur coat. The opossum goes about its business as usual, unaffected by its unusual bald state. It sniffs around, forages a bit, then ambles off, disappearing back into the dense woods from which it came. Seeing this peculiar version of a usually furry creature, one can't help but feel a mix of surprise and intrigue. In my opinion, while it's certainly an unusual sight, it's a reminder of the remarkable diversity and adaptability of wildlife, even under circumstances that seem strange to us. 
a driver's journey takes us into the heart of a small village, the road ahead captured by the dash camera. As the car proceeds, something unexpected crosses the path. A shadow with the distinct outline of a human figure, yet there's no one there. The form is transparent, more a wisp of smoke than flesh and bone, stirring thoughts of spectral apparitions. The camera doesn't falter, it records what seems impossible. A ghostly figure in broad daylight, transient yet unmistakably there. This fleeting encounter leaves us with a shiver, pondering the mysteries that might walk beside us, unseen. In truth, while the video is certainly eerie, there's likely a more mundane explanation, perhaps a trick of light or reflection. Still, it's a captivating glimpse that blurs the line between this world and the next, even if just for a moment. In the silent watch of the night, a camera, either a watchful eye above a secluded property or a trail camera nestled among the trees, stands guard. Its lens captures the stillness of the forest until an anomaly appears. In the right corner of the frame, a shadowy figure materializes. It walks with the outline of a human, or perhaps a creature native to the forest. Then just as suddenly, it disappears, gone without a trace. This unexpected visitor, captured only for an instant, raises questions. Is it a ghostly apparition wandering through the night, a simple malfunction of the camera, or a resident of the forest caught briefly in the artificial light. From what I see, while the idea of a ghost is thrilling, the rational explanation of a camera glitch or an animal briefly caught in the camera's limited night vision seems more likely. Nevertheless, the image provides a tantalizing mystery for the imagination. In the hushed seclusion of the woods, a man films his surroundings the camera's eye sweeping from one view to another. As he changes direction, the lens briefly captures an enigmatic sight on the street, a shadow shaped unmistakably like a human. However, there's no one casting it. The figure is transparent, an ethereal presence, in a place where only trees and the quiet of nature typically dwell. This transparent shadow challenges our understanding of the woods, a space we think we know. It stands out as a figure of intrigue, prompting us to ask whether it's a trick of the light, a reflection, or something more otherworldly. Considering the clarity of the human shape, it's hard not to feel a shiver of wonder. In my view, while the forest is full of natural marvels, this seems like a visual puzzle that invites more questions than answers. Could it be something supernatural? The possibility adds an element of mystery to an ordinary walk in the woods. A boy wanders through the woods at night, his camera recording the adventure. The darkness around him is thick, pierced only by the occasional beam of his flashlight. Suddenly, a humanoid figure leaps out in front of him, startling and unidentifiable. The creature, or person, gives chase, and the boy's steady walk turns into a frantic run. The camera jostles wildly as he flees, capturing only glimpses of the shadowy pursuer. The footage is raw and pulses with urgency, making us question what we're seeing. Is this a genuine encounter with a strange creature of the night, or could it be a friend in disguise? Orchestrating a prank in the perfect setting for a scare? In the moment, with adrenaline high and breaths coming fast, it might seem like the former. But reflecting on the video, it feels more likely to be a case of human mischief rather than an unearthly chase in the dark woods. Through the lens of a man's camera, we're guided through the eerie silence of an abandoned city. The structures around him are hollowed out, remnants of life that once filled these spaces. As the camera pans across the windows of a desolate building, a peculiar shadow catches his attention. It's indistinct, lacking a definite shape, hovering in the space where someone might have once looked out onto a bustling street. 
the ambiguity of the shadow in such a desolate place, whispers of ghost stories, the kind that cling to abandoned spaces. Could this fleeting shadow be a spectral resident left behind as the city emptied? While the imagination can run wild in such a setting, I'm inclined to think there's a less supernatural explanation. A trick of the light, perhaps, or a piece of debris stirred by the wind. Even so, in the absence of life, it's all too easy for the mind to fill the void with ghosts. A man's exploration of an abandoned building is documented through his camera. The silence of the forgotten space is palpable. As he turns a corner, the camera shakily reveals the back of the room where an unexpected figure looms. It's humanoid in shape, dark with large glaring eyes that seem to pierce through the dimness. The sight sends a jolt of fear through the man, and the camera's shake intensifies. <laughs> this unsettling presence raises a host of questions. Is it merely a trick of shadow and debris, or something living that calls the desolate building home? Or could it be someone? or something more mysterious. In such a setting, the mind may expect to encounter the unexplained, and fear can conjure phantoms from the mundane. Personally, I suspect the creature is less a specter, and more a play of light and nerves. Yet, it's the not knowing that sends a shiver up the spine. From the grainy view of a trail camera, set deep within the forest's embrace, we witness a scene that stirs the imagination the quality is poor, each frame smeared with the blur of low resolution, yet there's a distinct movement that commands our attention. Against the backdrop of a solitary tree, a shadowy figure emerges, walking upright on two feet in a manner that's all too human for a typical forest creature. This shadowy form strides into the frame, then just as quickly, it's swallowed by the dense tapestry of the woods. The suggestion of Bigfoot crosses our minds. It's a shape, a gait that folklore and whispers have long associated with the legendary being. Looking at the ambiguous silhouette, it's tempting to believe we're peering into the unknown. However, the skeptic in me leans towards a more earthly explanation. Perhaps a person out for a walk, distorted by the camera's limitations. In the realm of shadows and myths, truth often remains just out of focus. This is the CTV footage from a homeowner who claims to have had one of most terrifying encounters. We can see a man hanging outside the house with his wife and his dog. Far in the distance, a sound which seems like a strange dog barking can be heard. After a while it can be heard again, but this time closer to their fence. After a few more moments, the sound was getting closer and closer at a speed it was not normal. The sound changed from barking to what sounds like a bird. The owners were paying close attention now, but not knowing what exactly it was. They went inside the house. The next day, the owner went outside again for a smoke, but this time, the sound was like a deep, slow breathing one. It sounded even closer to him. Given how terrified the owner got, he went to look at the security footage, and that is when he saw this. A strange line of lights can be seen moving exactly in front of him. I am not sure whether this is a strange effect of the camera, or the sounds he was hearing were in fact from this thing. He claims that at the time he could not see anything, just hear heavy breathing close to him. So is this the footage of what appears to be a ghost. From the sound of the language the driver is speaking, it sounds like this footage is from Russia. The road is dark, with the only source of light being the car's headlight. Suddenly, in the distance, we can see a big figure pass in front of the car. The people inside the car start shouting upon spotting the creature, clearly not expecting to be met with this sight. <laughs> The creature quickly dashes out of their view into the forest. If we slow down the recording, we can see that the figure is pretty solid with what appears to be hair all over their body. It's difficult to say with certainty what the creature in the dash cam footage could be. Some may speculate that it could be Bigfoot or another type of undiscovered hominid. So could this be an Yeti or Bigfoot? My instincts say yes, however, it could be fake as well. But I applaud the efforts to dress up and go into the middle of nowhere just to film this if this is the case. What do you think? 
we can see the footage from a motorcyclist traveling through a forest, but we are immediately met with a very strange sight. Bones scattered around the forest trail evoke an unsettling feeling that something is not quite right in this place. The motorcyclist himself seems to be taken aback by the sight, but presses on, venturing deeper into the woods. The path he's on is difficult, with many fallen trees blocking his way, but he remains undeterred and continues onward, determined to reach his destination. He gets to a point where two small trees have fallen exactly on the road and are completely blocking his way forward, just as he's saying in the video. This is where most people would turn around. But he goes on and tries to move them aside. Not being able to do so, he tries to get his bike over them. But just as he is doing that, he hears something in the forest. The subtitles from his original video say that it was the sound of someone shouting for help. He hears branches breaking as something appears to be moving towards him. In that moment, his instincts take over and he decides to flee, turning his motorcycle around and speeding away from the source of the noise. But what really happened in the forest that day? Was it just his imagination playing tricks on him, or was there something more sinister lurking in the shadows? The bones scattered on the forest trail and the eerie howling in the distance suggest that this place might not be as safe as it seemed. Who or what could be responsible for these strange occurrences? What annoys me about this footage is that if he indeed heard help, just as he indicated by the subtitles he put on, then why turn around to flee when you hear someone coming towards you? Couldn't it be someone who is in danger and needs your help? But at the same time, for me, it did not sound like shouts for help, but rather as a very creepy howl. And in that case, I think he did the right thing. The footage that has been captured in the sewer is incredibly intriguing and mysterious. It immediately raises questions about what kind of creature could be lurking in the depths of the sewer system. The remote machine with the camera on it provides us with a unique and rare insight into a world that is normally hidden from view. As the footage begins, we can see the remote machine slowly making its way through the dark and murky tunnels of the sewer system. It's clear that whoever is controlling the device is searching for something, but what they find is truly startling. A strange figure with glowing eyes appears to be peeking around the corner as if it is watching the device's movements. The figure is tall and slender, with an unnerving pallor to its skin. Its glowing eyes seem to be fixed on the camera, and it looks as though it is assessing the situation before it decides to move. The creature appears to be cautious and wary of the device, but as the device moves further into the sewer system, the creature becomes bolder and we get a better look at its shape and form. It is clear that this is no ordinary creature and its appearance is enough to send chills down anyone's spine. Its movements are erratic and jerky and it seems to be watching the device's every move. As the creature becomes more confident, it moves closer and closer to the camera. Its pale skin and glowing eyes seem to be be illuminated by some unknown light source, and it looks as though it is about to pounce. But just as quickly as it appeared, the creature is scared off and runs away into the darkness. What kind of creature was that? Was it a previously undiscovered species or something even more sinister? The remote machine footage leaves us with more questions than answers, and it is clear that there is much more to be discovered in the depths of the sewer system. The video opens to the image of a dark and desolate country road. The car is stopped, as if the driver knows something up ahead is not right. Suddenly, we can see a very bizarre figure moving on all fours in the distance. It's not clear what it is, but the driver's instincts tell him to back away slowly. As the car begins to retreat, the camera zooms in on the creature, revealing a humanoid shape with a white appearance that appears to somewhat glimmer in the darkness. The creature moves with an eerie slowness and grace, its movements almost like those of a wild animal, yet it doesn't resemble any creature of the natural world. The driver is understandably terrified and keeps reversing, all while the creature continues to move slowly forward. As the creature comes into view, we can see its humanoid form more clearly, with a slender body and a head that almost seems to turn and look directly at the camera. Many speculate that this creature is none other than the legendary Skinwalker, a creature that has long been associated with dark and ominous folklore. But could it be something else? Something that has never been seen before? The driver's quick retreat leaves us with more questions than answers. What was that creature? And more importantly, what did it want? This footage is from a trail camera 
that seems to have caught something interesting in sight. On the left side of the camera, we can see some sort of an insect being up close to the lens, inspecting the camera. It moves back and forth, perhaps trying to find a way to eat the trail cam. Could this be a spider that wanted a bit of spotlight? There is nothing unnatural about this footage. But to me, as an arachnophob, it gave me a bit of a chill seeing its legs so close to my monitor. The trail camera footage captures a bizarre and intriguing moment in the life of a wild bear. In the dense forest, the bear spots something that he had never seen before, a mirror. The camera captures his reaction, which is nothing short of entertaining. The bear appears to be taken aback by the strange object, and at first seems unsure of what it could be. However, as he gets closer, goes on the offensive. In a sudden burst of fury, the bear starts attacking the mirror with all his might, as if he had come across an enemy in his territory. He stands up on his hind legs, attempting to make himself as big as possible, and unleashes a series of punches on the mirror. It's fascinating to watch how the bear's instincts kick in as he tries to ward off what he perceives to be a threat to his territory. Despite the futility of his attack, the bear doesn't give up and continues to lash out at the mirror until he finally manages to pull it down from the tree. The entire episode is a testament to the sheer power and ferocity of these magnificent creatures, as well as their curious nature. While the footage is certainly entertaining, it also raises some interesting questions about the behavior of wild animals. Do they have the capacity for self-awareness? Do they understand the concept of reflection? As the footage from the trail camera starts to play, a sense of unease quickly sets in. We see a hand, big and hairy, appear out of nowhere and reach for the camera lens. The hand inspects the camera curiously, as if trying to determine what this device is and what it does. But as the hand moves closer and closer, we realize that this is no ordinary hand. It looks more like a hand of a primate, with rough and calloused skin covered in coarse hair. The longer we watch the footage, the more we become convinced that this is not a human hand, but something else entirely. Could it be the hand of a monkey, a gorilla? The hand is so close and so clear, yet so mysterious and intriguing. And as it continues to move over the camera, we can't help but wonder what this creature is and what it wants. The nails on the hand are long and sturdy, adding to the feeling of unease that washes over us as we watch the footage. It's as if this creature has been living in the wild, using its hands to survive in a way that we can barely comprehend. The question that comes to mind, what kind of creature has hands like these? It's hard to ignore the possibility that this could be a Bigfoot, a legendary creature that has been the subject of countless sightings and encounters over the years. Perhaps this is a glimpse into the world of Bigfoot, a rare moment where it inadvertently reveals itself to us. As the footage ends, we are left with more questions than answers. Who or what was this creature? This story was shown all over news because of how strange everything surrounding it is. A Texas homeowner caught on his home security camera a bizarre sight, one he says has never seen before in 15 years since he's been living there. The owner has a front gate that he always keeps locked so his dogs do not run off. But one morning he found it wide open. Finding it strange, he went to his security camera to check what exactly happened. So I wake up in the morning, I usually check because there's a notification, right, for the, the security software. Once he took a view of the footage, he saw these photos taken by the security camera. A strange girl with long hair, dressed in a long white dress, appearing to be on his property in the middle of the night. These photos were taken around 1.50 a.m., a time where no one has any business out, especially not on someone else's property. She came all up to the door because I have a storm door, a screen door. Um, it was open. After looking more closely and asking the neighbors, no one has yet been able to identify who that might be. The other neighbors mentioned that they did not see or heard anything strange that night, 
and their own security camera did not catch anything. The fact that no one in the surrounding area heard or saw anything out of the ordinary only adds to the mystery. It's as if the figure appeared out of thin air, then disappeared just as suddenly, leaving behind only the unsettling images captured by the security camera. So, who exactly was that? Why were they in the middle of the night on this guy's property, and why did everything look so eerie? Could this have been a ghost, a lost soul trapped between this world and the next? Or was it something even more sinister, a malevolent entity seeking to harm the homeowner and his family? The footage captured by the driver's dashboard camera in the middle of the night was truly bizarre. The dark, winding road through the forest was already unsettling, but what they encountered was beyond belief. A strange, slender figure was crouched in the middle of the road, appearing to struggle with its movements as it tried to stand up. It was difficult to discern any specific details about the creature, but its movements were jerky and unnatural, making it clear that this was not a normal encounter. The driver, understandably frightened by this strange sight, began to slowly back away. But as they did so, a nagging thought began to take hold. What if this was a person in need of help? Despite the strange, almost otherworldly appearance of the creature, it did bear some resemblance to a human form. Perhaps this was an injured hiker, or someone who had been stranded in the woods for days. It would be wrong to simply abandon them. The driver wrestled with these conflicting thoughts for a moment, but ultimately decided that caution was the better part of valor. They tell that they slowly backed away from the creature, keeping a close eye on it in case it made any sudden movements and chose to take another road around. Did they do the right things, or should they have gone out of the car to check what that was? The owner of this trail camera claims the photo was taken by their motion detection trail camera. The photo captured by the motion detection trail camera shows a large and hairy creature walking in the forest. The creature appears to be accompanied by a smaller humanoid figure, possibly its child. The image itself is quite blurry, and it is difficult to make out any distinct features, but the overall shape of the creatures is visible. Could this strange trail cam site be evidence of the existence of Bigfoot? But what is more, infant Bigfoots as well? What makes this photo even more intriguing is the presence of two other black figures in the distance. It is unclear what these figures are, but they could possibly be more Bigfoots, adding weight to the argument that Bigfoots exist in large numbers. However, the authenticity of the photo is always a point of concern. With the rise of photo editing software, it is easy to create such images that can easily fool people. It is hard to say whether the photo is genuine or not, but it is a possibility that it could be fake. Regardless of its authenticity, the photo adds to the ongoing debate on the existence of Bigfoot. The idea of such creatures living amongst us is both thrilling and frightening at the same time. This trail camera caught the sight of a coyote wandering the forest at night, but unbeknownst to it, another predator was watching every move it makes. The coyote stops in the middle of the track and looks for a few seconds towards the direction where the forest looks pitch black, perhaps suspecting that something is out there. The coyote moves back and forth, marking its territory, while also taking a few other peeks in that direction. If we zoom the camera and brighten the footage a bit, we can see exactly why the coyote kept staring in that direction. A pair of big eyes can be seen between the trees, looking directly at the coyote. As the tension in the air grows thicker, one can't help but wonder what kind of creature is lurking in the darkness. Could it be a mountain lion, as some suggest, or is it something even more terrifying and unknown? This video was taken by someone in Serbia, and we can see some lady dancing all alone on an empty road at night. No one really knew who she was, but this was not the only sighting of her. Many other people claimed to have seen her 
and some relate that, if disturbed, she would become aggressive. The police were alerted by this, but did not manage to get any leads on her. However, some locals in Serbia are suggesting that this may not be a woman at all, but rather an entity from Serbian folklore known as Navijarka. This ghostly figure is said to haunt remote areas, appearing to men who are traveling alone at night. According to legend, Navijarka was once a living woman who was betrayed by her lover or husband, leading to her tragic death. Her spirit then returned to the world of the living, seeking revenge on men. Navijarka is often depicted as a beautiful young woman with long hair and a flowing white dress, which is somewhat dissimilar to the figure in the video. The legend suggests that she uses her beauty and charm to seduce men before leading them to dangerous or isolated areas where she either kills them or drives them insane. It's no wonder that people are reporting aggression when they try to disturb her. If Navajarka is, in fact, responsible for this video, she may be protecting her territory or seeking out a victim to protect oneself from Navajarka. It is suggested to avoid traveling alone at night, especially in remote areas. Carrying garlic or a mirror is also said to ward off her evil powers. Whether this is a real-life encounter with Navajarka or not, the fact remains that this video is a haunting sight that raises many questions about the paranormal and the unexplained. This video is a strange one. We can see someone heading for their front door, but once they open it, they are met in the middle of the night with the sight of a goat with glowing eyes sitting exactly at their door, looking straight at them. The goat is not aggressive, but it's an unexpected and bizarre sight, leaving the person who opened the door confused and uneasy. The person steps back and quickly shuts the door, locking it. As they move to the window, we can see the goat staring back at them through the glass, as if trying to communicate something or seeking shelter. The person behind the camera is clearly spooked and can be heard muttering in disbelief, wondering what to do. The video ends with the goat still staring back at them through the window. It's an unnerving sight, leaving us wondering what the goat's intentions could have been. Was it just a lost animal seeking shelter, or was it something more sinister? Is it a warning of something that might happen in the near future, or is it just a coincidence? Some viewers speculate that it could be a possessed or supernatural creature, drawn to the house for unknown reasons. The hunt for Bigfoot has always been shrouded in mystery, with many people dedicating their entire lives to finding the elusive creature. My name is Scott Carpenter, and I'm from Maryville, Tennessee. I'm a systems administrator, and I also am an amateur uh, Sasquatch researcher when I have the time. The man in this video was one such enthusiast that appeared in the show The Proof Is Out There and he was determined to prove that Bigfoot existed. He knew that he had to be cunning if he was going to capture evidence of the creature, so he came up with a plan. You leave food for the Sasquatch and you attempt to get DNA. Leaving food in the forest was a tactic that many Bigfoot hunters employed. The idea was that the creature would come to the food and then the hunters could collect DNA evidence from the leftovers. It was a risky move, but it was one that this man was willing to take in order to get closer to the truth. As he headed into the forest, he set up a camera on his back that would record everything behind him as he was traveling through the forest. He knew that he couldn't afford to miss any detail, as Bigfoot could appear at any moment. But as he reviewed the footage later, he realized that he had caught something incredible. The movement in the background caught his eye and he focused in on the spot. The more he watched, the clearer it became. There was a creature moving there. Although he was looking for a Bigfoot, he admits that it does not look like one, as the creature has somewhat of a snout that can be seen as it moves its head through the trees. The man was stunned when he realized what he had captured. He believed that he had seen a dogman, a creature that was half man and half dog. He knew that he had been in grave danger, 
as the dogman was a notoriously aggressive creature that was said to attack humans on sight. This video caused a stir in the Bigfoot and Dogman community, with many people claiming that it was the best evidence yet that the creature existed. Some skeptics dismissed it as a hoax, but the man who captured the footage was convinced that he had seen something real. The hunt for Bigfoot, or the famous Dogman, continues to this day, and this video serves as a reminder of just how elusive and mysterious the creature really is. For those who believe in its existence, it is a tantalizing glimpse of what might be lurking in the depths of the forest. As the video begins, we are met with an eerie silence of the night. The darkness of the road is only illuminated by the car's headlights, and the viewer can see that the car is stopped in the middle of the road. Suddenly, a strange and almost ghostly figure appears in the distance, running at an incredibly fast speed. As the figure moves across the screen, it becomes clear that this is no ordinary creature. The creature's form is difficult to discern in the darkness and blurriness of the video, but it appears to be fully white with four legs that are being used to move at an almost supernatural pace. The creature's shape is unlike anything that the viewer has ever seen before, resembling a human-like figure with arms that are being used as front legs. The creature's movements are smooth and fast, as those of a predator. Despite the apparent danger that the creature could pose, the people in the car remain transfixed by the strange and haunting sight in front of them. As the creature disappears into the night, the viewer is left with a sense of unease and wonder at the bizarre encounter that they have just witnessed. The authenticity of the video is, of course, a matter of debate. However, there is no denying the strange and unsettling nature of the creature that is captured on film. Whether it is a real creature or simply a clever hoax, the video is sure to spark curiosity and speculation among those who view it. This video was taken by the trail cam installed by someone on the land they own to watch for any predators that might be lurking nearby. But they were scared to notice not a wolf or bear, but rather a grey dressed figure walking slowly in the forest. The figure appears to move slowly and with no purpose, as if it is just wandering around. Despite being out in the open, it seems to have no concern for its surroundings as if it is completely comfortable in the wilderness. As the figure continues to move through the forest, it suddenly kneels down and then just as quickly stands up again. It's unclear what the figure is doing, but its movements are deliberate and intentional. The grey dress it is wearing adds to the otherworldly appearance. The viewer is left with many questions about what they just witnessed. Was this just a person in one of the cheapest ghost costumes or something more sinister? It's hard to say, but one thing is for sure, this footage raises more questions than it answers. Some believe it to be a ghost, a spirit of someone who may have died in the area or a cryptid, while others, myself included, see just a person with a sheet over their head wandering in the forest. Although I can understand the distress of the person who recorded that, catching a person randomly walking in such manner on your property would be quite scary. The video captures a moment that is both bizarre and heart-wrenching. As the footage begins, we see a small fox gingerly making its way across a backyard. However, upon closer inspection, it becomes clear that something is not quite right. The fox is walking on only its two front legs, using its tail to help balance itself as it moves. The scene is both fascinating and heartbreaking. The fox appears to be searching for food, using its front paws to dig around in the grass. Its movements are awkward and slow, a far cry from the quick and nimble maneuvers that foxes are known for. As the video progresses, it seems clear that the fox is comfortable with its unusual gait, almost as if it has adapted to its condition and learned how to thrive in spite of it. It's impossible to know for certain what happened to the fox. Perhaps it was the victim of a tragic accident, or maybe it was born with a genetic abnormality. Whatever the case, 
The sight of this creature struggling to survive in such a difficult state is a powerful reminder of the resilience of nature. As we watch the fox move across the yard, it's impossible not to feel a sense of admiration for its strength and determination. Despite its physical limitations, it has found a way to navigate the world and make the most of its circumstances. It's a lesson that all of us could stand to learn from, reminding us that even in the face of adversity, there is always a way forward. This trail camera caught a really strange sight. An alligator walking around in the middle of a forest. Usually you would expect to see alligators in swamps, marshes, lakes, and rivers, not in the middle of a forest. The alligator appears to be moving with purpose, not just aimlessly wandering around. It's clear that it knows where it's going and what it wants. As we watch the footage, we can see the alligator moving over fallen branches with ease. But why would an alligator venture so far from its natural habitat? One reason could be the search for food. Alligators are known to be opportunistic predators, and they will hunt anything that crosses their path. It's possible that the alligator has found a source of food in the forest, such as a pond or stream with plenty of fish. Another reason could be the search for shelter. Alligators need to regulate their body temperature, and they will often bask in the sun to do so. But if the weather is too hot, they may seek out a shaded area to cool off. A really unexpected sight for a trail camera, but an impressive one nonetheless. It's not every day that you see an alligator walking through the forest, and this trail camera capture is a rare and remarkable glimpse into the world of these fascinating animals. The footage captured by the trail camera is not just fascinating, but also shows the incredible survival skills of the squirrel. As the squirrel hops down from its tree, it begins to forage for food among the leaves on the ground. Suddenly, with lightning fast speed, a hawk swoops down from the sky, aiming for the squirrel. But the squirrel proves to be quicker than the hawk anticipated, as it makes a quick dodge to the side, causing the hawk to miss its intended target. The hawk, unable to stop its forward momentum, crashes headfirst into the tree trunk. It's amazing to see how the squirrel was able to react so quickly to the hawk's attack and avoid becoming its prey. This kind of behavior is not uncommon among squirrels, who are known for their agility and quick reflexes. They are able to move quickly and change direction rapidly, making it difficult for predators to catch them. As for the hawk, it quickly regains its bearings and flies away in search of another meal. The squirrel, meanwhile, takes off in the opposite direction, possibly a little shaken, but ultimately unscathed. This moment captured on the trail camera is not just impressive, but also humorous. Seeing the hawk crash into the tree is both unexpected and amusing. It serves as a reminder that in the animal kingdom, survival is not always easy, but sometimes it can be quite entertaining to watch. We can see two guys filming themselves in a forest. They say that as they were heading to their truck they left on the side of the road, they thought they had spotted a bear. But as they looked closer, they saw that it was way bigger than a normal bear. And it seemed that it was walking on two legs. Because of this, they started taking this recording. They thought they are dealing with a bear because of the brown fur. But now they are not sure what exactly they saw. We can then see the footage they are talking about. A strange black or brown figure can be spotted in the forest peeking at them. Once realizing it was spotted, it started running away, with one of the guys grabbing the camera and heading towards it. He runs a while after it, while shouting for Eric, the other guy, to bring his bow. After a while, they stop running, but continuing to look around, they start to question what they actually saw. Could it have been some kind of large animal they had never seen before? Or was it something else entirely? Something more mysterious and unknown? Gasping for air, they can be heard continuously saying that was not a bear. They get quiet to listen carefully, to see if they can spot the creature again. But the creature can no longer be seen anywhere. The creature we see between the trees 
seems to be fully covered in fur, standing on two feet given its height, and it seems to appear humanoid. So could this be the famous Bigfoot? It could as well be just fake, someone dressed in a monkey costume running around. The video has sparked a lot of discussion and debate among Bigfoot enthusiasts and skeptics alike. Some people believe that it's undeniable proof of the creature's existence, while others remain skeptical and point to the possibility of it being a hoax set up by the two guys. But what do you think? In this trail camera footage, we can see on the right some flashes of light. We can keep looking, but we won't really understand what that is, unless we brighten the footage. Once we do that, we can make up the figure of a strange creature looking straight at the camera. Its visage is truly terrifying, sharp glowing eyes that keep staring at the camera. But what is more terrifying is that as the video continues, we can see the eyes changing position to a point where it seems the creature is standing tall. Could it be a dog or wolf standing on its hind legs? If it were a dog or a wolf, would it be possible to stand this tall for so long? The creature does not seem to have moved closer to the camera, considering the eyes appear the same size as before, and yet we see them a lot higher in the air. So what exactly was that? The image of the creature is blurry, and it's hard to make out its shape or size, but we can tell that it's something out of the ordinary. What you are seeing here is not an alien, but rather a very rare creature that lives in deep ocean waters called Bigfin Squid. The Bigfin Squid, also known as Magnapinna, is a mysterious and enigmatic deep sea creature that has captured the imagination of many with its strange appearance and elusive behavior. This creature has been known to reach up to 23 feet in length, with long spindly tentacles that can stretch up to 26 feet in length. Its body is covered in a thick layer of gelatinous flesh, making it almost translucent in appearance. What makes the big fin squid truly intriguing is the fact that it has only been seen a handful of times, despite living in the depths of the ocean. Its appearance is so rare that scientists have only managed to study it through a handful of photographs and video footage. The big fin squid's strange and mysterious appearance has led many to believe that it may be a creature from another world, or even a harbinger of doom. Some say that it may be a creature that has been lurking in the ocean's depths for centuries, waiting to reveal itself to the world at just the right moment. While we may never know the true nature of this elusive creature, its presence in our world is a constant reminder of the mysteries that still exist in the depths of our oceans, waiting to be discovered. In this video we can see some strange creature rolling around in a pit of mud. As we observe this strange creature rolling around, we can't help but wonder what kind of creature it is. It's round, ball-like shape and tentacles wriggling around are certainly not like anything we have ever seen before. If we were to remove all the dirt on it, the creature's color would possibly be white or yellowish, but what really makes it unusual is the lack of any sign of a head or mouth. Could this be some kind of unknown aquatic creature, thrown onto land and struggling to survive its last moments? It's not impossible, given the vastness and depth of our oceans and the countless undiscovered species that reside there. Or could this be something else entirely? A toy or a remote control device designed to move around in a way that mimics a living creature? Despite the unsettling and mysterious nature of the creature, the cat nearby seems unfazed and even curious about it. It follows the creature closely, perhaps intrigued by the unusual sight, but we are left with more questions than answers. What is this creature, and where did it come from? The mystery remains unsolved. The title of this video I found online is Loch Ness Monster, and immediately we can see why. In the river close to a forest we can see some creature swimming, 
But this is no ordinary fish, as we see it has a somewhat snake appearance, and with a big tail at the end to help it swim. We can see the same creature in different instances from this video. Given the distance of the camera, it seems the creature to be of substantial size. But is this really Nessie? The Loch Ness Monster, or Nessie, is a legendary creature said to inhabit Loch Ness, a deep freshwater loch in the Scottish Highlands. The existence of this creature has been a topic of debate and speculation for many years, with numerous sightings and photographs claiming to provide evidence of its existence. Many people believe that Nessie is a surviving plesiosaur, a prehistoric marine reptile that lived during the dinosaur age. The creature in this video certainly bears a resemblance to the descriptions of Nessie, with its long serpentine body and powerful tail. However, without a closer look or further evidence, it is impossible to say for certain whether this is actually the Loch Ness Monster or another unknown creature. An eerie tale of a buck with a strange condition has surfaced in the wilderness. This deer was caught multiple times by different trail cameras and got a lot of attention for its neck position. Photos of this deer have emerged showing it with its head tilted back and mouth open, resembling a howling wolf. People at first thought it could be some strange paranormal sight, maybe some kind of shapeshifter, but the truth might be a lot more normal and sad. Wildlife biologists speculated that the buck had a food impaction in its jaw, causing an infection that ruptured and drained, leaving a gaping wound. Due to damage caused by this, the buck is unable to swallow normally, forcing it to raise its head to swallow its food. This unusual behavior was captured in dozens of images over five days, leaving viewers in shock and awe. Will this mysterious creature survive its ailment or succumb to its wounds? Only time will tell, but truly a strange sight. The ocean holds many secrets, but none as mysterious as the sighting in this footage taken in Israel. A seemingly ordinary video of waves crashing against rocks turns into a haunting experience when a bizarre creature is spotted. The camera is fixated on a rock, and at first, it appears to be a seal. The two men filming saying that to themselves, but on closer inspection, it is something far more unusual. Suddenly, the strange figure turns around, revealing a pale, blurry face, who then crawls towards the back of the rock before jumping into the sea. The two men are astonished by what they witnessed, realizing it was not a seal. If we analyze the video more closely, the mysterious figure does seem to take the form of a mermaid, a mythological creature of the sea. But could this really be a mermaid, or is it merely a CGI effect? The possibility of this being an optical illusion is not ruled out, but the thought of a mermaid existing in our world is enough to send shivers down one's spine. The ocean is vast and full of secrets, and who knows what else may be lurking in its depths. If you want to see more strange footage caught on trail camera, then watch this.